Two weeks ago, I was at a, I was running a health retreat in Alabama and there was a woman there who was 69. She looked 50. She's very well kept. She said, I have been uh, a, uh, she, she got a doctrine in nutrition and dietetics. So she was trained at the university 30, 40 years ago. She said, in my training, we were told that under 300 is perfectly safe cholesterol levels. Did you get that? They've changed it. Why have they changed it? The pharmaceutical companies got them to change it. Because if they can get someone on cholesterol-lowering medications, how long is a person told they're on it for? Life. If you're under 300, you're safe. Did you hear that? Already they dropped it to 200. Now they're dropping it down to 160. They, they've done a, so, so don't believe them. Now, two of the most common cholesterol-lowering medications are Lipitor and Crestor. How do they work? Well, they block the pathway in the liver that the liver uses to make cholesterol. And that same pathway is what the liver uses to make coenzyme Q10. What's coenzyme Q10? Your heart protective enzyme. So a person has a heart attack, goes on Lipitor or Crestol, can increase their risk because now they haven't got coenzyme Q10. Are you ready for the side effects of Lipitor and Crestol? Memory loss. Alzheimer's, dementia, muscle wasting, and they've just added another one, breast cancer. Because our sex hormones are made from cholesterol. Did everyone hear that? This man who's been on cholesterol-lowering medication for a long time now has erectile dysfunction. Uh-huh. Sex and memory loss. Anyone interested? <laughs> Give me a break. Mm -hmm. One lady said, I cannot stop. I said, why not? She said, the doctor said, I will die. Do you know you will not die? And personally, I'd rather die than spend my latter years with, with memory loss and dementia. Huh? And as you'll see tomorrow in our lecture on the mind, God never, ever designed that this brain deteriorate. So one of the biggest contributing factors is, uh, is these statin drugs. They are dangerous. I've got some good news. If you're on cholesterol-lowering medication, you can stop today with no side effects. Mm -hmm. To blame cholesterol is like blaming the fire trucks for the fire. Well, they're always at the fire, so they must have caused it. Can you see that? 